Okay, this is Joe Real. We are here uh, installing one uh, 34 Freon into a 2016 Buick. And the proper way to do it is like right here. We'll show you. Let's show them the screen there. Right now, we were we were below in the in the green, out of the green. Now we want to get up to 40. So what we do is, as Mark's doing, is demonstrating. You turn, oh, is that empty? This refrigerant has a sealant in it. Where's the new one? Oh, it's gonna be in the truck. You gotta be careful what refrigerant you put in here. If you have to, Google it, because every vehicle, uh, most vehicles between up to 2019, 2022, whatever, have R134, but they're changing it, and they also have a tag. You want to look for this and find the right Freon for your the vehicle. You don't want to just start pumping anything in there. So this one has a sealant. So let's demonstrate one more time because we had to get a new can. See how we are there? Squeeze the trigger, bro. See how it goes down? And now let it go so we can see where it goes. We want to be around 40. So if you like this, demonstration also you have a high side and a low side usually the high pressure is on the smaller line you want to put your freon into the smaller this cap this fitting will only fit it will not fit this side because it's too big this fitting is too big it will only fit the smaller fitting so don't worry about which one to put it on but you have to find it in this case we had to pull the the filter box out and everything blower to get to it so subscribe to my channel if you want to see more stuff.